web movements are becoming more and more popular, We're seeing an increase in them on the west coast. But they can be difficult to run, so the first time you run them, it's complicated as to what tables start where. So Bridge Score Plus has got I'll show you another neat little feature here, making use of a browser. I'm going to open that in a tab, that in a tab, that in a tab, that in a tab. So I've now got one, two, three, four additional tabs up here which are open from the program. So this is the diagram for a 15 table web movement and green is the tables, 1 through 13 and then 14, 15. With a layout like this you can actually see how the boards work. So the east-west pairs are in blue just like regular movement they get older, they go up as they play and after 13 they come round 14, 15. Regular Mitchell movement for east-west pairs and the boards as we see they just move down regularly so you start out with 1 through 26 at the first 13 tables as a normal 13 table Mitchell but let's look at tables 14 and 15 this diagram shows that boards 1 and 2 start at table 14 boards 25 and 26 and the tables share on a by stand between 14 and 15 so this diagram helps show how a, a 15 table web movement similarly here is a 16 table and just so you know even number tables and odd number of tables work differently so this is 16 is an even number of tables so in this setup for a web movement you divide by 2 you have 8 tables and then you have another 8 tables and the boards circulate within that 8 table movement um, the key thing is making sure you know where boards 1 and 2 start so for a 16 table movement boards 1 and 2 need to start at table 15. Same thing when we get to a 17 table movement you'll see that 15 table and 17 table is similar layout remember any odd number tables for a web movement has a different layout and this describes again who sits where and it's got each of the rounds so for rounds 1 through 13 you know who is playing which boards this case we have uh, two duplicated sets of 26 boards um, with a with three duplicated sets you can do a slightly different movement the reason I say that is that for this we have relays so in round one boards one and two um, are shared between 14 and 16 and similarly in round 13 now we go back to an 18 table, an even number, again split it in two, and two movements within the even number. So having these diagrams makes things very useful. We'll go back to Bridge Score Plus, and Web Mitchell is the name of the movement. So what we can do here, here is the 15 table web movement, and we can display the guide cards for that movement. So we would print these out. It shows you know, who sits where and what the movement is. So web movements are much easier to run, much better tools in Bridge Score Plus than in, in ACBL Score.